All right, y'all, look at what we're playing. The Stellar Blade Demo. And I gotta apologize, my... The fucking arm for my microphone. I went to adjust it a little bit. And the piece holding the microphone fucking snapped off. So now I gotta use my headset mic. And I know it sounds like fucking shit, but I didn't want to have to wait another day or two just to record a video. You know, the one time I decide... After taking a few weeks off to record, that my mic decides, the, the arm decides to fucking break. So I apologize that this is gonna sound like complete shit. But I've beaten this demo yesterday. And I've beaten the boss challenge, but I wanted to replay it again for YouTube. Um. Kinda some, some of my thoughts on the game so far. Let me see. Balanced. Turn subtitles off. Um, the game's actually pretty fun. Um, kind of not what I expected. Um, it seems kind of slower paced at times with like the combat, and then it'll pick up again once you start fighting like, uh, like the giant bosses. But I will say the game's been pretty fun. Um, I've been playing it on. On like the story mode just because I'm you know bad with like these souls like games um, I, I got so used to playing uh, rise of the Ronin with a combat so fast-paced that I'm like having a little trouble keeping up with As this game now, Squad 7 will the Alpha but I've been having fun with this game nonetheless so I'm really excited for the 26th of the pods entering atmosphere One minute until threshold is reached. I think just this game, like the set piece and everything, like this game looks fucking amazing. Threshold has been surpassed. Activating shield. And just beyond, like, the, the, the meme of Eve's but being the main focal point of everybody talking about this game, I think just the combat and like the gore and like the enemy designs is pretty sick. Cobra! Cobra! are getting fucked up right now. I might need to adjust the, uh, like, in-game audio. This is fucking loud. So hopefully you guys can hear everything that's going on. There's Eve. I think this is Eve's, yeah. Uh, no! Zero seven five three one, pod landing complete. Removing physical shield. Opening hatch. The hatch. Come on. Come on. Open. It's Taki. 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 Taki Taki. This place is dangerous. Take my hand.
Oh ma. Can't wait to see all the people bitching about this game. And I guarantee you there's really nobody who's gonna bitch about this game. It's just people wanting to, to cause problems. This way to the rendezvous. Let's check settings. Sound. Nope, oh, come on. Yeah, because I normally turn down like the music and the effects. You take the left. I'll take care of this side. For a quick attack. You got the strong attack. Oh. See, like, fighting against, like, these smaller enemies, the gameplay seems to move a little bit slower. But then you fight, like, these bigger enemies, like the bosses, and it seems like the combat moves a little bit faster. Like, I don't know how to really explain it. But, I mean, this game just looks fucking sick. You know, I say that, and I'm turning the camera around on Eve. That was close. Come here. Careful of your jump. Oh, come on. But you can't, like, look at this and think, damn, that just looks fucking sick. Watch out! It's unlisted Natiba. There we go. I want to check something. That's story mode. Display. Now we should be good. Watch out! There's more. No, I fucking missed that one right there. Beta skill. I'm so used to playing Rise of the Ronin and how fast paced that game is. And I keep wanting to press uh, triangle to uh, parry. Are you alright, Eve? <laughs> My body frame. Take this. It's first aid. Thank you. There's more of them. Rush! Holy shit. I want to parry this fool. There we go. Ha! There we go. before more of them show up. I'm following you, babe. You secured. Rendezvous point in sight. This way. Let's go. Watch out for Gardner's interception. Everybody's talking about Eve. I want to play as Taki, though. Taki, a baddie compared to Eve. I mean, they're both baddies, but. Don't stop. Keep moving, Eve. I think I'm just more, oh shit, interested in Tacky. But he's pretty cool. Oh shit. That was close. This isn't looking good. Let's go. 
The only thing that's looking good is you guys. Is that an Alpha Nativa? Let's join them. Let's join them. God dang him. Oh, my God. No, no. The squad's life signs. We're the only two left. They all dead. Eve. Eve, pull yourself together. Taki. Listen to me. We haven't completed our mission. Now it's just up to us to see this mission through. Understand? Yes, mommy. I mean, Taki. Here comes big boy. Eve, are you ready? Let's do this. Oh, I fucking buried him. Nice. Yeah, I'm about to fucking die. Oh. All right. Get up, Eve. Okay, it's like a parry one attack. That's what I'm trying to get better at is the parrying, but... It's so right after this boss will be in a new area anyways. I know, I'm dragging this out longer than what it needs to. Alright, well. Big boys just got, uh, double teamed right there. It wasn't an alpha, but it was a strong one. You fought well. Even better than during training. You were all together. But then... Uh, oh no. The damage to your body frame is serious. We have to find the supply camp. Wait, Eve. I hear something. Eve! Uh, uh. Eve, are you all right? Yes, I am fine. Alpha Nativa, 
These guys look fucking sick. I wonder if this is going to be considered a boss or like a regular enemy. Like, you can't see these kind of enemies and yes. think, damn, this looks pretty it's sick. No! no! Get out of here. No! Stellar Blade. I wonder how open this, like, open... It's quiet. How open this open... Still. I don't know I'm if sure this is cautious. gonna be more open world. It's where the Alpha and AT buys. Or if it's just gonna be more, like, linear. Like, they showed, like, the... The town, uh... Or the city, I guess, Zion. And then the wasteland, so I don't know if it's, like, you can just freely roam... Throughout the areas, or it's just, like, once you're done in an area, you don't come back. So that's what I'm kind of curious about. Now, get ready. I'll be supporting with the drone. So this must be eight or seven. Yes. This was the final battlefield of civilization. It was also known as a truly colossal city. Something is falling from the sky. A strange sensation. It's rain. This must be Earth's rain. We can admire the scenery later. We have a job to do here. Oh, sorry. The terrain data's changed recently. Uh, okay, so... I didn't even see this here, uh, when I played yesterday. So, I mean, yeah, it does make sense that, uh, there is the fast travel I've seen in the other spots, but I didn't see this one right over here. Oh, and I love that music. You see the rain falling on her. Oh, my. Uh, these are really the only two suits you get in this part, and then you get more stuff in the uh, the boss run. Something is coming. The crustacean type enemy. They're common around here. Oh, I was actually able to parry them. Damn. All right, area is clear. This is the legion that was killed in the final war. Roar Roa. 
There's an encrypted code in the memory stick. It's a security code. A type of entry permit. Try entering the code. I'll put that in here. Roar. Roa. Oh, did I? Whoops. No, oh, what did I put the last time? Oh well. I love just like the music. It's because of the city's unstable terrain. You'll get used to it soon. All right, Eve. Let's go for a swim. And as far as I know, there's no like. I don't know if you can drown if you're in here for too long. There's no like indicator. Oh, come on, Eve. There we go. Go, go, go. Got him. I don't even see the uh, other guy over here. There's a legion camp in a place like this. Thanks. Yeah, you gotta be careful. There's fucking enemies that'll hide behind. Uh, Corners and shit. Camps are places where you can save your progress and get some rest. You can activate them by obtaining vit coins found near camps. It's down on the chairs at camps to recover HP and refill the rechargeable tumbler. Your stored items will be retrieved if space is available. Some enemies will be revived when resting at the camp. Use a vending machine at a camp to purchase items. You can learn or train skills through the kiosk. So it says some enemies will be uh, revived. So I'm sure there's certain enemies that you might not be able to refight, I guess, after you beat them. Skill settings. You can learn a new skill. Oh, perfect dodge, okay. Or no, this is... This one I already have. Focus boost. Make it easier to use perfect parry. No, oh, okay. And here comes Adam. My hero. So we already know Tacky's gonna be like some sort of boss. Because we've seen her... Wrong? ...in uh, videos without the arm. So I'm curious to see how that works. From here on, you have to stay alert, Eve. Go, go, go. Action assist. You can use the action assist function in story mode. While action assist is active, time slows down when an enemy performs a powerful attack, and the controls for a counter skill will be displayed on the screen. 
You can enable or disable action assist under the gameplay sections. So I love that the the yellow uh, dots underneath. If you perfect parry and get rid of it, you can do like a very powerful attack. The uh, retribution uh, skill. I think that's what it was called, retribution. Yeah. Yeah, retribution. Oh, and he still has some health. There we go. Nothing really in there. Oh, it's one of the Legion's old supply boxes. Do you think there's anything useful? Potion. Well, it's Legion, so compatibility shouldn't be an issue. Make sure to take everything. Abe, be careful. You see the rapids below. If you fall, it's over. Huh. Swingy, swingy, swingy. Wah. I like how uh, in the controller you can feel the uh, the rain. That's pretty cool. I like the the vibrations. It's very subtle, but I like it. And then you can feel that, the, uh, the train. Oh, oh I fucking missed. I'm trying to get better with the parrying, but it's not gonna really... Hold on. There we go. Enemies maintain their stance with balance. Balance is displayed between the HP and shield gauge. By forming a perfect parry. Become groggy, then you can use retribution to deal massive damage. See, it's these kind of enemies that take their sweet time wanting to attack you. The boss that you fight later on, I was able to do more parries because he attacks faster. These kind of guys, they take their sweet time swinging their arms at you. Oh yeah, this guy. Come on. Come to attack me, boy. Ah, oh, shit. There we go. Dude, the enemy design in this game is fucking sick. Come on, one more. You want me? Come and get me. I mean, that was close. Ah, oh, there we go. Come on. There we go. It's fucking squid looking thing. Fucking creepy looking. Here is equipment that can improve Eve's combat capabilities. You can equip gear and gear sockets to, a, to boost your desired combat capabilities. Pressing the options button to enter the menu, you can collect Omni Bolts to unlock more slots. And equip more gear. Now 
I don't know if I mentioned this earlier. I'm playing on, I think it was called Balanced. So it's, you've got Performance, Balance, and then Quality. So I haven't tried uh, the, uh, I tried the Quality one that, I like, no, it's uh, Resolution. And then I think the, the lowest tier one that the PS5 games have that prioritize the uh, frame rate. Each game is kind of different with... Are all the cities in a similar state? With how they word it. By comparison, this city is looking pretty good. After the colony extinction, most places were nothing but dust. There's a fusion cell. Let's open the car's hood. There's a few enemies hiding around here, but... Oh, surprise! At least the fusion cell. No, oh, whoops, sorry Adam, I cut you off. Fusion cell? It's a high-energy compression battery. Thanks to that, Earth's night isn't dark yet. Oh, it's the previous generation of the infinity cell. Be sure to keep that. It's very valuable. You're very valuable, Adam. I wonder if she's met Lily yet or if she comes later on in the game. Oh! I didn't think I was going to be able to perfect dodge that. Come on, boy. Okay, so I'm like blocking the attacks, but it's not like perfect dodging it. Oh crap, hold on. Oh, it's funny, I was fighting this guy right here uh, yesterday, and I got out a little bit too far over there. Because I didn't want to get backed into a corner and a cutscene played, so I never got to explore back here yesterday. Cool. I got some more crates over here. What is this? No, but then there's a human right here, so maybe I'll be able to. Oh, so will I not be able to open this? Oh, but then there's some more humans over there. Maybe, uh, maybe because it's the demo, I can't open that one yet. Maybe that's why they have it fried, the, the memory stick. But I'm not sure if that's actually true or not. But if there is fast travel, maybe I can come back and re it's open it. I almost died right there. Whoops. Oh yeah, these guys. I remember them. Parried! No, I didn't parry that one. Oh, 
Oh, there we go. Heavy Guardian. We're in the clear. Where do we go now? This way. There are traces of marker. So I know there's another camp close by. Yeah, let me heal up. See, I feel like with these smaller enemies, getting at least one or two parries on them just to build up your uh, beta is, is fine. I think just trying to go for perfect parries every single attack is what's going to be my downfall because I'm so bad with with the timing. May your memories live on. Beta core. Number of beta cores required for max beta energy increase. So I need two more of those. I hope they release... Uh, like this music on like Spotify or something. Cause a lot of it sounds really fucking good. Um There's a lot of stuff around here. Let's see. Oh my god, the yellow paint is, is back to, to show me where to go. Oh my god. Oh, a core. Stick still has the security code registered. It also has record of a message log. Scan complete. There was something down over here. Oh, that's the money. Money, money, money. Yeah, I don't think there's anything down over there. I will say... Oh, okay, Adam. Yes, I see it. I can't reach the ladder. The water level is too low. Oh yeah, I forgot there's, uh, like a swimming mechanic I can try. Dive. I will say, once you get used to this game's, uh, mechanics... And like how the enemies react and stuff, it's not as bad. I know the fucking the enemy that you fight in the boss challenge. Up, because that uh, that one's more of the uh, unlike the no I guess normal difficulty. So I'm I'm sure on easier. Uh, or like the story mode, I'll be able to have a easier time fighting him. But I was actually able to beat him yesterday. It took me a few tries. Oh my! Sliding up and down uh, ladders. Uh, I've seen all that uh, floating around online. Uh, this way. Oh. 
Yeah, oh, okay. <laughs> Whoops. Come on. This game's fucking awesome. I don't care what anybody says. See, I love having a... A good-looking protagonist like this. And then just with everything else. Just the gameplay. The atmosphere. All that. It, it's just been really good. Shock grenade. Yeah, that might come in handy against the uh, the boss that's coming up later. Well, I say later, but... No, I still need... After perfect parry... Hold square... And triangle... Oh, hell yeah. We have to go through this building. Try putting the fusion cell you have here. Oh, you can reopen this and come right back out here. Oh, okay. I didn't notice that yesterday. Oh, these fucking guys. Well, I want a perfect parry, this weirdo. Aha, uh -huh, miss me. Come on, handyman. Oh, get fucking retribution. Barnacle. Oh, barnacles. Fucking parried. Oh. Oh, fucking parried. I think I'm definitely gonna do a, uh, a let's play of this game because I'm gonna be off for uh, my birthday because this game came, comes out uh, the Friday before my birthday. So 
So I know that Friday, Saturday, Sunday, as long as I have the room to myself to record, I'll be uh, doing the Let's Play for this. Oh, yeah, I gotta put this in there. Now one of the handymans. Eve is protected by a shield. Eve has damage reduction while the shield is active and the damage reduction effect increases as the shield protection level increases. The protection level decreases after each time the shield takes a certain amount of damage. Some enemies are also protected by a shield. Enemies have damage reduction while the shield is active. Destroy the shield to stun the enemy and disrupt their skill use. because I got all that beta I'm able to use uh, two different abilities alright let me oh barnacles Thought I dodged that. Right. What is this? It's a map. Adam, what is this? Don't you know this already? It's a map. A map? How do you synchronize the location on the map? Plastic Carts, Volume 3. Advanced Polymer Metal. Oh, looks like this used to be a library. Are these boxes displayed on the wall storage devices? Sort of. They can only store up to one megabyte of data. What a waste of resources. True that. Back outside into the rain. The crack is quite deep. It's going to be difficult to pass. We'll have to go across, past the parking tower. quick go 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 parking tower and another one of her squad mates Body core. Forever. Number of body cores required for max HP increase, so I need two more. A supply camp in a place like this. 
Supply camp? What's that? It's a depot. Set up by the airborne squad who came here before. Huh. Looks like it's been abandoned for a long time. How come they set up a camp in a corner like this? Well, the supply camp also serves as an important base. Is this parking lot important? It could also mean that this place is very dangerous. Then I guess this place could be useful for us. You're damn right it is. Supply camp features more devices than regular camps. You can use the repair console here to enhance weapons, increase the rechargeable tumbler count, and upgrade your exospines and upgrade Eve's combat capabilities. Also, you can upgrade your drone, craft nano suits, and fast travel to other camps. Yeah, so I'm not going to be able to make uh, outfits yet. That won't be until the main game, unfortunately. No, so I can't do these. But attack power. Uh, whoops. Just in case, because I know uh, coming up is the Abaddon boss. Blink. Oh, yeah. Select a skill at the kiosk to train it. You can also try out skills you haven't learned yet. If you're not used to combat, try increasing your proficiency with various skills through training. When an enemy glows blue and attempts a fatal attack, use blink to counter it. The enemy was in this within the skills range, Eve's sword will glow the same color. Press L and circle when Eve's sword glows to move to the target's rear and counter attack. Cure. Yeah, let's rest up. Adam? Yeah? About yesterday. Thank you for saving me. You're welcome. It's nothing, really. Though I have used up almost all of the exospine materials that I collected over the years. Oh. It's all right. That now means we can help each other. We can track down the Alpha Nativa together. And, well, I'd have trouble making it out here by myself anyway. If you can locate the Hall of Records, you'll have done more than enough. Listen, don't worry. I promise, I'll make sure to repay you. Oh, ma. Alright, so now I think I gotta keep heading upwards. Yep, the yellow paint's telling me where to go. Yeah, so I can't go through there yet. I'm sure after fighting, uh... 
what was it, the Abaddon, I think it was called? I'm sure I'll be able to explore this place more. That's not an ordinary enemy. Adam, get back. Adam's in the Adam's part of the drone, or he he is the drone. Oh shit. Oh shit. See, I'm having a much better time parrying this guy. I feel like when their attacks are a bit faster, I'm able to parry better. But when they want to do that slow, drawn-out attack, that's when I'm fucking terrible at parrying. Oh, here comes the lightning attacks. Oh, shit. Just a trailer. That outfit looks pretty cool. So does that one. I mean, they all look good. So I wonder how the ammo's gonna work for the drone. Something serious seems to have happened. I have to return to Zion. Oh my goodness. It's full of plants and little birds. God damn. I think I might actually try the boss challenge again. Just for the recording. I don't know if I'm gonna beat him, but I don't wanna spend all, all day trying to record and and beat the boss. It's like what, three or four more weeks left until this game comes out.
Alright, let's try the boss challenge again. And you got this outfit. And you got a bunch of stuff here, too. Give her the glasses. Yeah, you get like a bunch. Oh, wow, there's a bunch of different stuff here. Yeah, what did I have uh, equipped yesterday? Generation. Racers high. Planet diving suit. Second and then wasteland adventurer. And then this one you can use the uh, the drone. boss challenge there's no uh this is more of like the normal difficulty so it's no story mode i'm not even gonna try parrying him or maybe i will oh shit Okay, so I am doing some good uh, parrying on him, but... See, the thing is, if you're not good with parrying, then don't even bother. Oh, whoa. Oh, nah. try it again that was pretty I was pretty close uh, does it yeah and then I'll just skip this That 
purple move. I don't know what I'm technically supposed to do there. Oh, fuck that running move he does. fall over. Oh, come on. Oh, there's other... I can actually use that too. I'd even. there were these other uh, like grenades holy shit you see that's what got me fucking killed I got greedy oh well but that's the gist of it exit to the main menu yeah I'll, I'll take the I'll take the defeat but yeah that's pretty much the stellar blade demo I mean obviously if I fought the boss on I guess the more story mode it'll probably be a tad bit easier but I think that's just the gist of the game and what to expect I'm I'm impressed um, I'm very excited for this game I want to say we got like what four or five more weeks let me check so as of, well, when the demo came out, it came out yesterday, the 29th. So you got one, two, three, four. So about four more weeks left. So oh, thank you so much for joining me, guys. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.